Uh, ignorance. Ignorance is behind the criticism of Sahel Muhammad. Sahel Muhammad is an extraordinary American who is an outstanding lawyer and played an integral role in the post-September 11th period in building bridges between the Muslim American community in this state and law enforcement. I was there for it. I saw it personally. And the folks who criticized my appointment to Sahel Muhammad are ignorant, absolutely ignorant of that. And they're criticizing him because he's a Muslim American. And because he represented people who were inappropriately detained by the FBI post 9-11. Now, the fact of the matter is, there were lots of people inappropriately detained by the FBI post 9-11. It was a very difficult time for law enforcement. And so Hale Muhammad represented, as part of his practice at that time, folks who were inappropriately detained. None of them that Sohail Muhammad represented ever were charged with any crimes of terrorism. And they were, they were released because of his diligent and zealous representation of them. In addition to that, he set up for me, the U.S. Attorney's Office, and the FBI personally, dozens of meetings with Muslim American leaders across the state to convince them that federal law enforcement could be trusted in the aftermath of September 11th and that they should be working with us to provide information and leads to help to combat potential terrorist attacks in our state. That's the kind of guy Sohail Muhammad is. And I was proud to nominate him. I was disgusted, candidly, by some of the questions he was asked by both parties at the Senate Judiciary Committee. I thought it was awful. And, um, but in the end, the Senate did the right thing because the facts were undeniable that Sohail Muhammad is an outstanding attorney and will be an outstanding judge. And I'm going there to be at his swearing in today because he's someone who merited my support with my nomination of him, and I am confident that he'll be an outstanding judge. Second Muslim American to be put on the bench here in New Jersey. I'm proud to have been able to do that, but not just because he's a Muslim American. I nominated Sohail Muhammad because he's a good lawyer and an outstanding human being, and that's what people get to know about Sohail over his time on the bench. Sharia law has nothing to do with this at all. It's crazy. It's crazy that guy's an American citizen who has been an admitted lawyer to practice in the state of New Jersey, swearing an oath to uphold the laws of New Jersey, the Constitution of the state of New Jersey, and the Constitution of the United States of America, and has never been accused of doing anything but honorably and zealously acquitting the oath he took when he became a lawyer to license to practice in this state. And so this Sharia law business is crap. It's just crazy. And I'm tired of dealing with the crazies. I mean, you know, it's, it's, it's just unnecessary to be accusing this guy of things just because of his religious background. And that's what it's because because I've known him personally now for nine years. And there is nothing to any of this stuff. I'm not going to talk about Sharia law because Sharia law has nothing to do with Sho Sohail Muhammad and his time as a lawyer or his service on the bench in Passaic County, which I know will be long and honorable, and the people of Passaic County, people of the state will benefit from it. I'm happy that he's willing to serve after all this baloney.